It's been a year. The memes are becoming staler. Views are growing scarcer. The children, they scream. They're so hungry. I must make another view grab video. Hello everyone, hope you're doing fine. If you're not, hang in there mate, you got this. And today I'm gonna do a video without my glasses. So what's it for today's video? Today I'm gonna be telling you how to be British. So basically that means time for the racism and cultural stereotypes. Number one, the accent. Now, if you're planning on being British anytime soon, you'll have to choose between two accents. Either you talk like you're the upper class and you bloody well know it, or you talk like you're on the floor and you bloody well know it, innit? Number two, tea. Now you all knew that we were gonna get here at some point. Britons bloody love tea. That jolly good refreshing beverage, I got that. Know what I mean? To be a Briton, tea has to be your entire life. Breakfast, tea. Supper, tea. Tea. You're taking the bath? You better bloody have some fucking tea bags, mate. Number three, apologize to everyone, but also judge everyone. You have to apologize whenever you bump into or in any way inconvenience someone. Now, just apologize for the bloody lot of it. Or secretly, you'll get together with your mates and you'll judge the bloody hell out of them, eh, lads? Ain't that right, lads? Number four, fish and chips. This is like the tea part. You're only ever allowed to eat fish and chips. Everything else tastes like dog's bollocks in it. Wait. That's a good thing in British slang. Number five, Doctor Who. This is Britain's pride and joy when it comes to television drama. Uh, well, apart from Sherlock. Doctor Who and the aforementioned detective drama are the only two television series worth watching if you're gonna be British, honestly. Number six, complain about everything. The weather. <laughs> it's too <Bye>. bloody rainy. <laughs> it's too bloody sunny. <laughs> it's too bloody windy. I don't know why I'm being affected by the wind, I'm inside. The music? Ugh, music nowadays is so boring and thoughtless. Why aren't kids listening to the Beatles and the Who like the good old days? Politics? Ugh, those Brexiters, bloody wankers. Ugh, those Bremainers, bloody wankers. The size of your bloody animals. It is your God-given right as a Briton to complain about absolutely anything you want to your heart's content. Number seven. And finally, the shitness. Britain is a country riddled with racism, poverty, homelessness, and corruption. What horrors lie inside the borders of this once great country can only be imagined as it starts to fall apart. Ireland, Scotland, Wales, they'll all leave us and Britain will be left as a salted, charred piece of land that once ruled the world but now to real I guess. Anyway, that's it for this video. If you liked it, give the like button and a cheeky little tickle. If you want to see more, give the subscribe button and a cheeky little tickle. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!